try that again. Hopefully that doesn't sound terrible. If it's still there, I'm gonna cry. If it's still here, I'm gonna cry. I will, trust me, I will, I'll do it. On, on mic, I'll cry. But hopefully so far, hopefully it doesn't. I'm so sorry about that. We had to start the stream again. Um, let me listen. I'm so sorry. I'm so, so, so sorry. Okay, the game is loud and the mic is low. That is the issue. Hello. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Okay, how do I sound now? I've adjusted it. I hope I sound better. I hope I sound not just good, not just fancy, not just great. I want to sound fucking mm, sexy for you. Yes, okay, we sound good, yo. Okay, cool. Well, let me let my mom know I had to reset my, my stream, because if not, she's going to kill me. She'll kick my ass. Again. First, we got to make sure I can plug in, uh, see whether or not I can plug in a uh, set of earbuds into this Yeti mic. And if it still sounds like, you know, crystal clear, if it still sounds crystal clear, we'll be good. It sounds crystal clear? Oh my god. It sounds crystal clear. Oh my god. It sounds crystal clear. Okay. There we go, guys. Awesome. So sorry about that. That was so <laughs> unnecessary. <laughs> oh, thank you, Nods. I, I'm. <laughs> I don't know if I sound great. I feel like I sound okay at best. Um, it's about you after all the audio kinks. Thank you so much, everybody, for waiting. We're about to start. Uh, let me just let my mom know that I'm starting, and then we'll be going. Uh, I also have to check that it looks good on a computer screen, which is part of why I have my computer still set up. didn't hit enter. What the hell? I was like waiting for it to come up. <laughs> okay, good. Cool. Good. Okay. Make sure it sounds okay. Looks good. Looks good to me, bro. Hey, buddy. Logs. Woo. Thanks very much for watching. Uh, let me, I'll be right back. I'll be right back, right back, right back, right back. Thank you.
Okay. Mm, I'm back. I'm on the stream for a bit too. It was so hard. If you're wanting a long stream. And thank God if it sounds bad, right? <laughs> Let's get, let's get going. Let's get going, yeah. Let's hit new game. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> Give a fuck. Frosty, welcome. Dear doctor, or dear Mr. Charles Reed, as you requested, I've researched the outburst of hysteria and visions in the city of Oakmont, Mass. It turns out that your assumptions were correct. Such cases are indeed more frequent here. Men and women from across the country are drawn to Oakmont, haunted by visions similar to yours. A city drowning, the presence of something great yet unknown. As luck has it, I believe we have stumbled upon the source of your ailment, and the person who might help you with it. Prepare yourself, and come to Oakmont as soon as you can. I'll meet you here to help you on your way, cordially. Johannes van der Berg. Okay. Okay, there you go, friends. I was like, wait. <laughs> It's alright, buddy. You breathe. You're good. You're good. Yeah. That's not helpful. <laughs> Maybe it is. Knocked by that trance. you in a different game, didn't I? <laughs> right? Or did I not beat you? I mean, you're an elder's being, I get it, but... Oh my fucking god, that's the sunken city. Right? Oh. Oh, shit. Find a place that's like fucking <laughs> squeak so goddamn much. It's just a problem because it's you can hear it squeak all the fucking time. Ah, because I lean backwards, bring the table forward. There we go, 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 go. There we go. <coughs> Welcome to Color Cthulhu. This is my pistol. <laughs> Hope I never have to use it, but something tells me I will. <laughs> Yeah, trust me. <coughs> okay, so let her read just read. I'm not gonna read it again. Folding camera. Okay. Frosty, welcome. As you requested, I've researched the outburst. Of <laughs> you almost tricked me, you motherfucker. <laughs> you motherfucker. You almost tricked me. Into giving you some random uh, reading, you motherfucker. How do you use anything? <laughs> Yeah, 
you're not helping me, game. Okay, that activates our, our mode, but doesn't... There we go. Photo trophy plate. Oh, and this is like our first instance of just getting to loot for some fucking reason. <laughs> Never trust I thought that would just a had a R shit in it. Oh, loot thing. Never trust a tourist advertisement. Lore. Trophy plate with a strange fish. Looks very lifelike. Ugh. Alright. Is that it? Hmm. <laughs> How does... I would like to double check one thing before you're going. Make sure it looks good. Yeah, that looks good. Mm. Hello, Todd. Uh, get out! Oh, uh, you get out! Fucking asshole. I just got here. At last, Mr. Charles. Mr. Reed. What a pleasure to finally meet you in the What are you, German, you French prick? <laughs> Johannes Vanderberg, at your service. I did promise to meet you the moment you arrived. Ah, much obliged. You Mr. did, Vanderberg. yes. <laughs> I guess I didn't expect you to mean so literally. Please call me Johannes. <laughs> Please but call me Johannes. <laughs> Welcome to the proud just city of <laughs> Call me something just as long. Last now is not its finest hour, though it is its most important. Oh, welcome forth, viewer. Hello. What is the deal with this city? Reaching Oakmont was no easy task. Most maps I found didn't mark it, and this rickety packet ship is the only one that sailed here. Why is that? Oakmont is no ordinary place. This game looks pretty It's unique good. geographical position and the flood, a recent natural disaster, make it nigh impossible to reach. But you made it, Mr. Reed. I'm sure the tides of fate would have brought you here one way or another. <laughs> about my poor bloom, please. My I don't know, I'm being French. The visions have been getting worse. The visions. Such vividness of visions is not uncommon in Oakmont. By chance, the man I spoke of, Robert Throgmorton, is already at the port. He has dedicated a lot of time and effort to investigate this issue. Alas, I fear he has a more pressing matter on his hands. How can I find Mr. Throgmorton? Don't worry, you can't miss him. Throgmorton tends to... <laughs> Stand out from the crowd. I'll need a place to lay my head while I'm here. Any recommendations? Fair not. I've already feathered a nest for you. There's a room in your name at the Devil's Reef Hotel. Here's the key. Sounds charming. Don't judge a book by its cover, Mr. Reed. Valid. That's on me. Valid. What's the best way to get around Oakmont? I'd like to drop my things at the hotel. <sighs> Most locals go by foot they want to... or by boat. I've got the latter sorted for you. There's one waiting outside the port. Ah, you're too kind, Johannes. Can you steer me towards the Devil's Reef? Take this map. I've marked the hotel and a few other key places. No, I gotta ask. I gotta ask. <laughs> what else did you mark on the map? Places. What? what else You're you get private me? eye, yes? Well, I highlighted the police station, city archive, newspaper. Places you'll need to get to the truth. This city is insular. Its ways mysterious. Hmm. No one will take you by the hand, so you better know where to turn in search of a lead. Hey, what do you do here? How do you fill your days, Mr. Vanderberg? I host a philosophy club for the like-minded intelligentsia. 
gathering seeds of thought, like moths drawn to a flame. So it won't really have yeah. much of a market for philosophy these days. There is no <laughs> That's kind of a prick. Pain, Mr. Reed. Mr. Reed. No better moment for clarity than times of hardship. Well, goodbye. That's it for now, I think. Uh, thanks for helping me get my bearings. No, no. The pleasure was mine. I love you, Skittles, bro. Oh, before you go, how can I get in touch with you later? Don't worry about it. I'm the kind of man who finds you. Mm -hmm. We'll meet again, Mr. Reed. Okay. Jesus. So much junk for you. I have a gun. Okay, now it's loaded. I have a brick and a med kit. The stick with the best kind of shooting. <laughs> Photography. Actually, hold on. Real quick. Johannes, hello. There you go. <laughs> Monty Johannes. Alright, i to duck. That allows me to do nothing. And the nothing, okay. Um, <laughs> guns aren't going to reload themselves. Fair enough. Thank you for telling me, I guess it does. Oh, this is. That was so gross going directly into there. <laughs> that was so. This looks like a death trap, what the fuck? Titania, I like book. it here, newcomer. Well, get used to it. No one leaves Oakmont nowadays. Why is that? I, could, I just came, I could leave. Can't catch a mackerel since those Innsmouthers took over the fishing business. Who are Innsmouthers? Tell me. Not like I've already played this game. Where's your Oberon, huh, Titania? <laughs> Is that supposed to be funny? I was kind of like... <laughs> Something with this helmet gives me chills. What's wrong with it? Something on the... The edge of it. Or the outside of it. It's gross. There's obviously something wrong with it. I hope that someone finds this. My name is Albert Throgmorton. And this is my will. I want to warn you, don't go to the depths below, Oakmont. There's an unru... We should have never done that. Everything should have remained in that cave. Professor M I fear that will become of me. I'm singing in my brain. Singing to my brain, dancing on my eyelids every time I close my eyes. <laughs> and the cycle goes on and on and on and on and on. And in the end, it comes. I must warn everyone I must tell my father he's here. Okay. Cool. So, something happened, and I assume to his kid. <laughs> so. <laughs> I, guess, I suppose we just saved ourselves some fucking time, didn't we? <laughs> Ew, what the f fuck? <laughs> so gross. What is this place? Oh, Jesus. Sir. I don't care about your petty excuses. No one leaves the port until my son is found, and that is fine. Uh, uh, excuse me. Are you Robert Throgmorton? <laughs> Hello. But not Excuse me. Go away. Uh, hello. My name's Charles Reed. I'm a private investigator. Just arrived from Boston. I was told you might be able to help me. Private investigator, you say? Well, perhaps we can help each other. If I may ask, what happened to your son? Why do you care? 
What's your angle, outsider? Well, like I said, I'm a PI. Finding people is kind of my specialty. Is it? Well, Albert was part of a deep sea expedition I commissioned. This useless fool over here says he found Albert washed ashore in a lifeboat. Says he was barely conscious, out of his Why is mind, he useless? talking gibberish in some other language. But he even tried to bite him. And you don't believe him? Complete malarkey. I know my the best of his game. I raced him well, strong and I feel like sounds a bit of a pompous of eight kind. faces in there. It couldn't have been him. Albert's disappearance is the work of Innsmouthers. Mark my words. Innsmouthers? Who are Innsmouthers? I take it you're not the biggest fan of these Innsmouthers. Those fish face freaks fish face. have run okay. this city since the police burned Apes, fish faces. But now... Those filthy These fish people are supposed to be from like the ancient city, city, aren't they? The poor Migrants, oh god. Bay, Salvation Harbor, the shells, to be fair, look at the city, it's covered in water. I think fish people kind of own this place. Refugees. <laughs> Hardly. They've taken work from the local fishermen. They stir and agitate against us. The Throgmorton <sighs> family. Why are you like this, sir? We are the pillar of this community. Why can't you just mention the peaceful. crime rates of skyrocketed? I'm cool. Simply speaking, they Good are a me. big stinking pile of trouble. Your features are unusual. <laughs> I'm just gonna say it, bro. I'm sorry. I've never met a man quite like you before. Probably honest. Because no man measures up to the Throgmorton lineage. Proud and powerful blood flows through our veins. So we don't mix much then, huh? A certain royal family, which has blessed all our offspring with these exquisite features. Exquisite. <laughs> mm. Visions, outbreaks of hysteria. I'm trying to get to the bottom of it myself. Another newcomer with another problem. <laughs> Yes, I know what you speak of. Can I ask you a few questions? Oh, Leave it there, please. You. My son Albert is missing, and no one in this Innsmouth ridden city will do a damn Come thing. Come on, man. But yes, let's talk about your dreams. Fine, Mr. Try Frog, to find Albert. Let me help you. I'm rather good at tracking down Mr. I get it. Okay, fine. I'm sorry. I get it. I'm, I'm being a dick. What I get it. What makes you think you can do it? Oakmont is not exactly friendly to new arrivals. Watch me, bitch. Let's just say, I tend to see things that others miss. And anyway, what have you got to lose? Sounds like you could use every man. Yeah, sounds like a good desperate shit, yeah. You have a point, Vera. Yeah. Vera? Yeah. Did you just say Vera? What does that mean? You had better get used to the Oakmont dialect, outsider. It is if you want to fit in. It is a fascinating blend. Vera means fine. I was saying, we have a deal. I see. Thank you. I need to know more okay. about what happened to Albert. Take, Elaborate, please, sir. Did you not listen at all? I already told you everything. After leaving on the expedition, Albert was found on the shore in a lifeboat. He really tested my patience. Supposedly brought him to the house, and then left to call me. His pompous nature upset me. I arrived here. My son was nowhere to be seen. Anything else? Clearly, something suspicious occurred inside the house. Suspicious house. For case sake, I thought you were a prank. Okay, say I'm right, but I've it. Life. Yes. Face the house. Then to the left is a beach that borders a fence. You'll find it there. Oh, he's great at giving directions. As much as I'm enjoying the weather, Mr. Throgmorton, it's time for me to get started. I was impressed, Find actually. my son, newcomer, and be quick about it. And again, I suppose he's pompous for a reason. Evidence. Let me go to... So we have the case book. He has request. Once we find his son, Albert, who went missing from the port after returning from an expedition from sea. He was found barely conscious. Who brought him to the house? Fisherman says that the Albert was mentally afflicted and acted aggressively before disappearing. Robert arrived to investigate and is nasty. Oh, excuse me. 
is now standing in front of the house in question. Until he's found, Robert won't allow anyone to leave the port, and he won't help me. Like a absolute tool. Okay, I got fine jackasses, kid. I know I have the will, I'm gonna mind pals. I don't have any deductions to make yet, and we don't have anything to combine. So let's go talk, shall we? Everything I know. Don't do anything stupid, newcomer, and keep your hands where I can see them. So there's a cop and the personal kind of guard, it looks like. And this is our like <laughs> our private eye site. So enter the first room before we continue looking. Ah. This dog mat looks better than the owner's bed. <laughs> Honestly, true. That dog mat looks very woven. It's next to the furnace. It has a little bone for the dog to chew on. It looks crusty. Your bed looks crusty, broken, and about to fall apart. Why do you have so much dirt in here? At least fucking dig it up before you put a cabinet, bro. Jeez. Jeez, man. Have some glass. <laughs> like, oh, I'm like, oh, wow. He reads, though. They read. I don't want to assume. Sorry. Sorry. I don't want to assume. They read. The book read. is damp and damaged, but clearly well cared for. Okay. I feel like they give a crap. They certainly give a shit. About a falling apart place, even if it is falling apart. And at least they give a shit about their items. <laughs> they don't give a fuck about the place itself. Oh, God. Don't tell me they eat that. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. That's nasty. It's nasty. It would take tremendous effort to move this thing, let alone tossing it over like this. That is true. I'm sure you get it. Let me see. Okay, that's... Roughly a little... Two thirds our height in width. And that's just width. It has multiple. So it looks to be our chest width and width. <laughs> so I would say it's probably about at least our height and length. And it's pretty width. Got a decent width on it. It's all sturdy wood, so There's yeah, I would say it's probably heavy as fuck. But someone tried to flee. Okay, how do you know there's a fierce fight? Well, I, mean, I guess the blood is a goal fight. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's why. Oh, the dead guy. <laughs> Let's see what you find, newcomer. All right, you shithead, and try me. Hello. Hey. Can you hear me? Hey, punk ass. Police? I've already told them everything. It's okay. I'm Charles Reed, Private Eye. Mr. Throgmorton hired me to find his son. Oh, oh, okay. What do you want? Well, sorry for making it, Shane. Come on. I want to know what happened here. Every detail. I don't remember much. Me, Paul, and Lewis. We were here. Mm -hmm. This is our house. Barry was outside on his business. Then he came back carrying Barry. Dog Morton's son. He was unconscious. Barely breathing. Who's Barry? Barry left again to call Mr. Robert. What's a Barry? <laughs> put the guy in Lewis's room. And he started to make these horrible sounds and okay. My head began to burst and he woke up. He was saying something that you can't After comprehend. That, I don't though. remember a thing, just dreams. Mess your mind. Drowned streets, a sleeping giant, a voice that called me. Ah. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Hmm. Tell me about yourself. Who are you? Uh, name's Will. Will Hammond. I'm a fisherman. We all are. Live here together. Me, poor fellow Paul, Barry, and Innsmouth of Lewis Flynn. We moved here after the flood. Okay, Lewis is in out there. I worked on the railroad, but the rail ain't kicking anymore, so I started fishing. It was out of starve. Why don't you leave? Yeah, I don't know, maybe I'm just... Uh, that's Paul there on the floor. Okay, be with him. 
Barry's yeah, outside with Mr. Throgmorton. <laughs> Lucky rascal missed everything. And I have no idea what Mr. Throgmorton's son got. I'm worst. Oh no. Let me real quick. It loses the end's mouth there, right? Okay. Let me get this bag of talkies. Hot. Mm mm mm. I'm in a bomb. Oh, Paul died. I don't know. When I pulled myself together, he was already gone. Let me get this. Show him the crap. Let's just be on my snacks ready. Tell me, who's just God, huh? Okay, you keep mentioning. Outside, I show some respect. He is our Lord, our light, our love. Sorry, I didn't know. I always shook my spit, Jesus Christ. I'll leave you to it. I'm like a good child. Yourself, Will. Please, detective, sir, tell me the truth. Could it be me? Did I kill Paul? Or did I kill him? <sighs> the police will stop anyone coming in or out of here, Swazi. I'm afraid of what I might dream. That's not really my issue, bro. Sorry. I think you still I need it. I really recognize the face of the poor fella. <coughs> I was beaten to a pulp. Damn. Oh, 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 God. Okay. Okay. Five cards short of a full house. Five cards short. <laughs> so nothing. I'm surprised they don't have someone's portrait here. <coughs> well, excuse me. Oh. What the hell? <laughs> Bro. Um. Retro cognition. That's certainly neat. Anything with a nurse? I've seen knives like this before. Masterful work. I mean, it's like fishbone, right? Sounds like Thick prohibition fish bone, hasn't affected Oakmont too much. During prohibition times, I forget that major theme with uh, all this uh, Call of Duty stuff. So that's what an end's mouther looks like. How do you get this? <laughs> How do you get some? I don't believe it. Take this, ape face. Take that. So he went to go shoot the guy. To be fair, he did just kill his fucking friend. Or was about to. Yeah, run! Look, to be fair, he went for his friend. Just saying. Wait, actually, before we go outside, let's go back up here. I'm missing something. So this was Luce's room. Yeah, it's nothing. What's happening? Okay, let's see what we have here. Okay. Get one. An easy version to be like, blah, blah, blah. Take this. Yeah, run! When Albert Throgmorton Green, woke okay. up, he was not himself. He attacked the fishermen and his hysteria spread to them. When he got wounded, he fled. Oh god, let's get moving. Hmm. Says I'm missing info. I saw something I haven't found yet. Hmm. What could I have missed? Well, Hammond, uh, House Brawl. Albert attacked the fisherman. Albert Throgmort was dangerous and posed a threat to Lewis Flynn and his fellow fishermen. Oliver Thogmullen was dangerous. 
Um, one fisherman is missing. And they fled when they were wounded. Okay, so the fisherman and Lewis fled a scene after a fight in the house. Track him using my supernatural senses. Okay. Set in psychotic. Albert fled when wounded. Lewis shot without warning. Albert returned unstable. Albert Throckmorton spread some sort of psychic influence, which made everyone suffer hysteria nearby. Okay. Hmm. Because of the inn's mouth, their Lewis and his people suffered at the hands of Throckmorton. That could be a reason to hate them and have shot. But it's without reason. I don't know if I would say without reason. Sounds like uh, he was being attacked. Well, that might just be me. What's in here? There's a bed. Oh, nice old mirror. Choo choo. <clears throat> choo choo. <laughs> okay. Evidence includes loot. Understood. So if I don't loot everything, I get all the air wrench. Okay, they're running this way. Shell mm. casing. Okay, some more shots are taken. Fisherman pursued Albert. Even let off a few shots. I mean. In defense, yeah, but having continued to go do it, that's been shame, bro. I can't. Why'd you even chase him? Why even chase him? There was frankly no need. Hmm. Even though Albert was wounded, he managed to climb that high. Robert wasn't exaggerating when he said he raised him strong. I mean, <laughs> apes, man. They got certain strength we don't. I'm just saying. I feel like it's quite literally just what how it is, you know? Okay, we're at the warehouse. Let's get some evidence. Let's do a sweep of the top floors. Oh. Uh, there's something in the pocket. Lewis, please just give me one more week. I know I owe you. I'm underwater like everyone else right now. I don't have enough stock to operate the bars smoothly with the fuzz snooping about the port, all right? Well, don't worry. I've struck a nice deal with the proper people and should have a, a steady supply channel soon. There's one more week and I'll return everything with double interest. Be ya. All right. Hmm. The blood is fresh. Whomever it belongs to could not have got far. Lewis was a uh, loading money, huh? Was he laundering? Uh, uh, not already laundering. I guess it's not money laundering, but um, a debt guy. You know, a guy who like gets you in debt in order to be able to kind of charge you way too much interest. He's like yeah, the kind of guy you go to when you're desperate. Okay, fish hole. How do I am? Where's my melee? Oh. There we go. Oh, God. Oh, what the fuck is are you? Guy. I'm not gonna waste my ammo on you. You die as well, motherfucker. What the fuck? Albert One fatal oh. round through the forehead. That's no accident. This was deliberate. Yeah, man. If not, why are you accidentally just pop someone, you know, execution style? You don't casually off someone, you know. Cursed crab, exactly. It's the worst kind of crab. The one that makes you go, hoo hoo. Hoo hoo. But you would probably still eat it, wouldn't you? 
<laughs> this may have wanted to kill Albert outright just because he's a Throgmorton instead of just running him off. Valid. So he probably, yeah, he would probably went to the bar. Let's go to the bar. Because even though we confronted him, I mean, I suppose we could go to Throgmorton first and see what we can get. But I feel like I, it's going to ask me to go to the bar first in order to, I guess, get all the evidence. But it's like, mm, he's, the kid's dead. He's over there. Son was murdered. Mr. Throgmorton, I'm afraid I have bad news. So sorry, sir. Yeah. Found your son in the basement of a nearby Can warehouse. you a backflip? <laughs> I'm sorry, but he was murdered. Shot in the head and the body hidden. No. It cannot be true. Always the hardest part, man. No, no. Breaking no. the death of a child. I don't believe it. No. I'm sorry for your loss. This is Mr. Thorborn. I had hoped for a happier outcome. Your condolences will not bring him back. So much of our blood spilt for nothing. So much effort in vain. My poor Albert. Tell me you know who did it. I want to look him in the eyes. Make him beg for me. Find me that dirt bag and I'll help you with anything you need. We need to get in good with Throgmorton. Hey, yo, by the way, I'm in the sun's will. I found this. I think you, uh, as a parent, probably are. Give it to you should me. probably be allowed to have this. You get yourself into. If only I hadn't sent you on that cursed expedition. Not my fault, though. Mr. Throgmorton, uh, I've encountered something. Uh, what? I don't have all day. Some uh, unusual creatures, and they sure weren't friendly. You've seen a wild beast, Mr. Reed. I'm somewhat surprised to see you still alive. Those unsettling things appeared after the flood. I'm a badass, I can I say. Studies on them. Two quick swift rooms and I won. They're aggressive, but you can't take me out with a simple little bitch ass wow yeah. beast, please. Like Hello hand. everyone, thank Try you for watching. Them when possible. And when you can't keep your weapons handy. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <sighs> Well, I guess we'll have to keep our weapons very handy, because between murderous fishmen and wild beast, as he calls them, we have a lot trying to kill us here. Uh, I just happen to have known that the bar was over here. Hey, get a spare bullet, bullet fella. fella. I ain't eaten in days. Oh. Yeah, okay, I'm sorry, man. You look familiar. But old, but old Billy, Billy hasn't, hasn't seen you around. around. Are you Billy? I hope so. <laughs> if not, that's weird. You're just referring to a random person. Stay alert. Monsters lurk underground. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. Ugh, I'll miss the carpenter's food giveaway with this darn port closure. Wow. Everything's fucked. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, a shotgun. Hi. To under the keel. What do you want? Under the keel. Can I get you some drinks? Um, <laughs> I need to find Lewis Flynn. Lewis Flynn. Any chances here? Yeah. Even if I knew, I don't rat to newcomers. Hey, when I'm gone, I'm gonna help. As it happens, a criminal. I know you owe a debt to Mr. Flynn. Trouble is. I found your note near the dead body of Albert Throgmorton, son of Robert. So, it seems Lewis is in trouble. Might have even come here to hide. But you hand him over, and he won't be back to collect what you... Oh, need. that's slimy what we just did. Rock. That would explain the blood. Fine. If it gets me out of this mess, you can have him. So, he's so upstairs. So he's made plenty of enemies, not my fault. I'm gonna get his ass. You gotta promise to I'm honestly pretty Once sure he's... Save the shooting for outside, huh? Smart man. There's your good deed for the day. I've seen some 
unsettling. Gonna bring the creatures up again. Just like constantly like, like, hey, oh, I'm missing some things, bro. Okay. <laughs> so you met a wild beast, newcomer. No one knows what they are, but consider yourself lucky to still be at one piece. They arrived in the. They seem pretty easy to kill, though. Some say they come from the sea. Others a day. My combat's on normal. My tactics on hard. And what do you say? This is not like it's even on easy <laughs> combat. Keep your gun handy. And if you want to erase the memory, I sell a perfect cure right here. That's a good salesman. Better to be a coward and live than brave and dead. Unless you're a newcomer. Where'd they come from? Where'd they go? Cotton Eye Joe. Right. Mr. Crab meet Mr. Wheat. Don't do that again. Don't do that again. I'll kill your fucking ass. Don't want me, bitch. Talking smack to me. Gotta loot everything. And there's no weight limit. This is better than Skyrim. I can loot everything. Hey, what's up? Come. Come closer, troubled soul. You're some kind of uh, fortune teller? I don't know if it's gonna be worth it. Yes. Everything is probably so expensive oh. here. It's so clear. We'll need what we can take, yeah? Your path holds many surprises, newcomer. <laughs> Seems Nonsense. A generic, don't you think? Mm. I see. Downright generic. Boy. Like, <laughs> she's not even trying, homie. Detail for a small fee. All right, how much? A dollar? <laughs> Your money has no value here, newcomer. After the flood, Oakmonter's deal in the So they trade pretty much. Booze, Oops, shit, sorry. <laughs> and bullets, and I'll make it easier for you. I don't smoke. <sighs> I'm not gonna have some other time. Maybe. Not gonna pair. Bullets are too uh, valuable in this game. She's nothing to us. What the? Get the! Oh. <laughs> what the fuck? Get the, I can't even finish the goddamn sentence since you're around. God damn it. Oh my god. You're inappropriate. Can I say of it all? Quid quo quo. It's all the same fucking save. File. Uh, in that case. I don't know. I don't really care. I'll just do the bottom one. Hello, hey, Mr. Albert. You? What are you doing? Albert I'm Lewis. Charles Reed, private investigator. You ugly fuck. <laughs> Mr. Throgmorton hired me to find his son Albert, so I you think you know why I'm Jackass here. ugly Throg. fuck. <laughs> that darn bartender. It was all that crazy ape's fault. You hear me? Calm down. I only want to speak for now. But no, if you reach for your gun, you'll hit the floor faster than you can say poetic justice. I got nothing to hide. <laughs> I wrote those things are hard. I'm pretty fucking okay. How did that all happen? Start at the beginning. Tell me what happened. What happened? We... We, we were in our house, me, Paul, and Will. Ah, uh, so gone. Mary gone to the sea. So I told him that it would only bring bad luck. If he'd listened to me, we'd all still be alive. Come on, Lewis. Focus. Right. Well, Barry dragged that damn ape to our house. He was bragging about how much Mr. Throg Morton would give us for saving his son. But that ape, he was out here. cold. Then woke in an instant and started screaming. Clearly doesn't like him. Us. After that, can't remember a thing. So you killed him. Why? You shot to kill. No warning, no second chances. You pursued Albert yeah. even after he fled. Why? Not nah, surprised. I just can't trust you on. Well, I can't remember it. When he woke. It was like a, a bloody mist descended over me. First I'm sorry. I recall, <laughs> you were in a rage, my right, homie. That's it. Covered in blood. I had you no saw idea red. what happened, though. I suspected it had something to do with that ape. Turns out, I was right. How do you say that? Your actions look the deliberate. The you did to Albert don't look like a bloody rage. Very. Very deliberate. 
One might start to wonder if it was deliberate. Mm -hmm. I don't know what to say. I wasn't myself. <laughs> I just can't believe that, man. I'm sorry. What kind of? Uh, Why do you? Why do you <laughs> your fucking face. face. Um. Uh, oh, so it's you gross. attack me just because I look different to you? Wanna spit on me? Whisper to your friends? No, I want. I want to turn What's you into a sushi roll. No, That's besides the fucking point. I, I just want to know why you like that. Before. I didn't mean any offense. Innsmouther's bodies were blessed by, blessed by the sea. You see, Poseidon yes, fucked all our moms and just you know, jizz them into the sea. We are proud of who we are. What do you, imagine Poseidon just fucked the actual ocean itself, like the ice caps, and that's where they came from. I hear there's a bit of a feud between the Innsmouthers and the Throgmortons. Big reason to want to off the kid, in. just saying. Us from the moment we arrived in Oakmont, our home was destroyed. We just needed a place to stay. The Blackwood well, Grand family I understand that. That's us, totally valid. Others were not as hospitable. However... We needed jobs, food, medicine. The city denied it all. And so... We had to fight for every crumb of bread. Get it, come here. And those Throg Mortons in their high I get it. I get it. I, 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 I'm very personally pro-immigration. I think it's messed up when we treat people wrong. setting people against us. After. I'd love to see them suffer. Have to come here. You know? You Tell me, what's a grand, grand family? family? What do you mean? Hmm. So you're a newcomer. Cause like if they're not gonna give it to you, why is you guys yeah. move on? Unless you had enough, you had enough of a reason to stay. Answer the question. Okay. People here are crazy about blood. That's what I'm bringing up. You had a reason to stay, so obviously. The headhunters are there's, you, there's enough anger. Grand families. There's the carpenters you. who control most of the the underworld. The Blackwoods who share kin with Innsmouthers through the Marsh family. And let me guess, the Throg Carpenters. Mortals. Right. Those filthy apes. Now that most of the Blackwoods are gone, there's nobody left to protect us Innsmouthers. I think I'll bring to the uh, Blackwoods. Please, hmm? Mr. Reeve, don't tell Throgmorton about me. I know I'm in no position to ask. I didn't want to do whatever it is I did. Honest, have mercy. I can't believe you, man. I have a family. Without me, they'll starve. <sighs> I'll think about it. This is not exactly cut and dry. I need some time to think. Perhaps I can offer something to grease your grinds. I still have a few Ooh. bullets. Ooh. Uh, I have a deal. It turns out I arrived here unprepared for business. You give me a little something to get started, and my lips are sealed. I knew you'd understand. Here you are, Mr. Reed. I get even more from my man. <laughs> Watch this. We're gonna go turn him into Throgmorton. Take what I can and get this dirty criminal out of here. Take what you can, give nothing back. Learn a lot from Jack Sparrow. Yeah, I don't believe that he was mentally affected. Alright. From what I can tell, even though things are going on. You deliberately murdered Albert. Psychic group influencer now loose out to murder Albert Thogmorton. Yet a motive too, the mutual hatred between the Innsmouthers and Thogmortons. Honestly, well I agree, justice is desired, but <sighs> See, I just don't believe that. I believe he did it. I believe from looking at it, I don't believe there's like <laughs> there's no reason. I know it kind of comes like from a very like corrupt cop sounding angle, but like let's just think about it. If you had to look at the evidence, he just why did he have to run towards him? If he if he would have like been hiding there from the beginning, they'd be like, okay, he didn't do it, but he ran towards him. He killed him. He admitted it. He admitted it. Murderers at the bar. Just as I suspected, the Innsmouth or Lewis is responsible for your son's murder. 
He's hiding at the local bar. Just ask the bartender. So like this guy will be worse in Smelter I just realized that. Took it out on Albert. Oh, that scum won't be getting off easy. The whole city oh, just shit. What happens when you cross <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Justice, bittersweet as it is, shall be served. It's rare for a newcomer to make himself so useful. Thank you. I don't like this. <laughs> I kind of feel weird. I hate to press you, but do you think you could help me now? Yes, you've earned it. Can you to think and come up barely off the boat? Solve the crime. The police could. I'm amazing. I'm a badass. I am the ace detective. Objection. I'm looking into an outbreak of erratic behavior and madness. Not my shit. All uh, other people. Yeah. Place. Then our goals align. This inexplicable hysteria has spread through Oakmont after the flood. I funded an expedition to explore recent geological activity that may be responsible. Geological. I was gonna say, yeah. I was looking down. Like, why geological? But there we go. Expedition. I'm not sure I follow. I have reason to believe the flood and this madness of the same source. As above, so below. So I sent men to find out. Do these cases of hysteria involve shared visions as well? Since the flood, many Oakmonters have had similar nightmares. Indeed, Professor Doe, the expedition leader, complained of them herself. Waterlogged ruins with unnatural architecture. A sleeping giant, drowned streets, and a voice calling from the depths. Her words exactly. She proposed the expedition, desperately wanting to find the He's like, oh, you, do you know her? No. You mentioned the flood. This is weird. It gets more than just a natural disaster. We weren't here, Mr. Reed. What happened? I, I do like that you're a scientist, though. I trust you more. I need you. I need you more. So tell me, you need discovery so far? Found anything? I do not know. Albert is. Albert was part of it. His passing cannot be coincidence. Why was he alone at the port? And where are the others? Tell me, please. Do you think your son was killed because the expedition uncovered something? Is it so hard to believe? I had no news for a week that Albert, the only one I could trust, comes ashore and is killed. It does sound suspicious. Mr. Reed. Hmm. I want you to find out what's going on. Suspicious, but I expect you're as interested in valid. results as I am. I know we were. Tell me more about uh, let's talk payment. expenses. They will be reimbursed after you complete your task. And of course, you've earned some compensation for your work here at the port. I they also aren't. include a fair advance in bullets. Uh, bullets? The dollar lost its use here, Mr. Reed. After the flood, Oakmont returned to bartering. Bullets mean more than bills. Alright, interesting. Burn ball caps. To know more. It's too bad, Fallout. <laughs> Where should I start? I'll give you the address of the expedition's headquarters and a key. That's all you can tell me? Let me be clear, Reed. <laughs> you do not speak to me like that again. I'm sorry, Mr. Throckmorton. I just meant the more I know, the better. I am a busy man. <sighs> I found the research that left all preparations to Professor Doe and... Albert, when you finished, come see me at the Throgmorton family manor. It's in Old Grove. Here, I'll show you. Okay, okay, let's see. Oh, let me move my phone so I can actually see any chats. Okay, what did we get? Okay, I got our case book. Key to my headquarters and lost expeditions. So we should probably go to my hotel, yeah. 
uh, one knowledge point and some experience points. I think we should, yeah, make our ability last sane longer and more experience. Probably best, right? A bit more like multi-use. Hmm. Okay. I can craft if I need it, but I think we'll wait to craft it until we need it. Purely because we're gonna find enough, probably. Or at least a lot. Hmm. This place looks fucking gross, though. The bar under the keel. But it's not like the top of this made of like a boat. Or whatever. <laughs> whatever. Who needs continuity and rationality? I'll just explore this place and fuck around because, you know, <laughs> that's what they were doing when they were writing this shit. <laughs> oh, fuck me, that's mean. That's, that might have been mean, I'm sorry. <laughs> When did I get a revolver? Or did I just have it until I... I just needed ammunition. Oh, me okay, medication, I assume, for if we're going fucking bat crap crazy. We're gonna need... I assume we're gonna need to manage our medication and everything else. It's over here. Anything else? Hello? Anything? Oh, okay. Apparently I should have came back here. <laughs> oh, fuck. Please let me up. And over. Thank you. God, I would hate to fall in the water. It just looks gross. <laughs> Everything in this game looks fucking gross. I'm gonna ask the actual, like, little low end dock. Um, like, low end boats, like little dinghies and shiz, you know. Nothing too impressive. I wanna go check them out real quick. Because I know it happens already. I've only played, like, I think, maybe 20% of this game. I want to see if I can save myself a bit of time. Since we completed the Rockmorton's Cache, right? Have you appeared? No, I assume it mu he must appear after we get knowledge about the boat. Yeah, the boat's not here either. It must be something that. Cause, oh, that's right, because. Uh, uh, never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Let's just go walk around. Hi, sir. Keep Join praying. In, newcomer. Praise the sea with us. Join what? In, newcomer. Yeah, I'm, I'm good, bro. <laughs> I, I'm not praising nothing, really. May God. Praise God. Um. Praise myself. I need more praise. Mm hmm. I give myself too much negativity. More praise would be good. Um, maybe more praising of valuable goods. I don't know. <laughs> Just kind of making shit. Up. <laughs> How much you ever get to this dude? Oh. The end is nigh. It will begin again. What is down comes up. The seed is so Okay. Before we move on, I'm just checking if there's anything I can get or do while I'm here. We're playing a very thorough detective, and I want to be extra thorough then. You know? I want to play into my character traits and aspects. Okay. So clearly... I was useless. <laughs> but hopefully that kind of idea will be better beyond the tutorial area. Because I think right now this is still set in tutorial mode. Which is a point here. Hmm. 
Speaking of which, I'll show you. There we go, now I can run. Now I know how. Mm-hmm. Did I lose health? When did I lose health? Oh, on the pipe, maybe. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, God damn it. I don't want to die. <laughs> Ow, my fucking head. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, now we're just at the hotel, okay? Cool. Thanks for the inexplicable... <laughs> Okay, so Robert Throckmorton funded an expedition to discover the origin of a mass hysteria grope, <laughs> groping. <laughs> Sexually harassing Oakmont. No, a gripping Oakmont. The expedition was to explore the seabed near Oakmont. Contact with the expedition was soon lost. Albert Throckmorton was the only kn known survivor. He was subsequently murdered. Inspired to find out any other expedition members, dead or alive, Throckmorton would be awaiting my report in his manner instead of an old grove. Okay. I think... We're gonna play like a truth over anything kind of detective, you know? My diary, part one. Mmm. Let me drink water first. I don't know what exactly sank the USS Cyclops. Only we remember the screams and the metal creaking, water filling deck and my headache. The worst I've ever had. I found myself among the floating seaweed drowning and a nearby piece of boat helped me survive and reached the shore of a small island. They found me on the on it later, half starving, half mad and babbling about the ancient ruins and their denizens. The officials said none of what I thought I had seen was real, but my memories are true. My strange powers gain after that ordeal. Prove it. I found something horrible on that island. Something old, dark, and slithering. And it still haunts me. What the fuck? Army buddy. Cyclops. Semper Fortis, brothers. What does that mean? Semper Fortis. USN Charles W. Reed 3 21 17 to 10 9 All that we see or seem is just a dream within a dream. Okay. Oh! <laughs> yeah, another uh, protagonist with a, <laughs> a bit of an opium thing. <laughs> No matter how much of this I chug down, the visions always return. Cause that has nothing to do with them, homie. Just saying. Let me get more talking real quick. So sorry for the sound in the background. Mmm. Of course, I have the DLC so we can make them look good. Mmm. <laughs> Vacation, Dad Reed. Let me know which one you want, Nadia. Or anyone else who is watching as well. Windcoat. Unburden newcomer and newcomer. I'll be right back. I'm going to get my water. You let me know which one you want.
I'm back. I'm back. I'm shady. I'm back. See so what the vacation is? This one? I'll give you a moment to catch up. Get up! <laughs> Alright, we're a tourist here. We are we're going full tourist to dad. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let me make sure everything still looks good on my uh, computer, yeah? Mm hmm. Looks fantastic. Okay. Vacation dad mode activated. Let's go. Hilarious. Oh my god. Yes, I'm Mark. I work at an office normally. Um, I, uh, I file taxes and uh, have missionary sex with my wife every night. <laughs> the number of tax on the ins mount <laughs> immigrants has increased. <laughs> Raids are intensifying with more and more ins mount there's exposed to abuse and assault. Sometimes whole families are found dead in their houses. Police are in the case with several illegal ins mount businesses captured. And their owners sent to jail. This city ought to have been cleaned of these fish-faced scum long ago," said Robert Throckmorton, head of the Throckmorton Grand family. I regret only one thing: it all started too late. Had we neglected our civic duties, my son Albert would still be here with us. Ah, oh, fuck. He's probably faking some of that evidence, which makes me feel bad. We did this to them. Mr. Reed, it seems that you overexerted yourself while conducting the investigation. For Mr. Throckmorton, forgive me for the audacity, but I brought you to the Devil's Reef while you're unconscious. Please, take more care of yourself in the future. I want to be there for you every time. Johannes. Note from J. Van der Berg. Every single stereotypical German. What can I say? Color Cthulhu has a lot of stereotypes. That's where we like it. It's funny. And I still have access to guns and stuff, but I'm vacation dad. Well, there's loot like every floor, shall we? Be unnecessary thorough. Unnecessarily thorough. What the fuck? <laughs> I put up the windows and locked the door. They were just men, the yellow kings gang. They can't get here now. Now there's only me, me, and these nightmares. A little longer and I'll figure them out. Okay. Wow. Um. Alright, dude. <laughs> Charles W. Reese. This place detective. feel more like home. This is Boston, Boston already. already. Mr. Archer, I've seen you dragging things into your room. Mind the floors. I'll make you pay for any scratches you leave. Your landlord. And his khakis, <clears throat> four pockets. And remember, they're men's pockets, so they're deep. The door won't budge. Door won't budge. Damn it. <laughs> men's pockets are just naturally deeper. We can keep an entire folding camera. We got a, a Colt 1911. A it looks like a 385, 38 revolver. Uh, a brick, <laughs> one med kit, and two sets of uh, mental med kits. Like I, I assume, like smelling salts and like med like, men like pills and shit to help keep us sane. Totally just break into other people's houses. I don't really care. <laughs> ah, let us search. I need everything more than they do. Too many coincidences. So the lighthouse is out. Several ships have gone lost at sea, and some are now decorating the city's beaches. That's one thing, but there is an enterprising fellow at the city port hiring salvagers to recover ships. He's turning a tidy profit for some of them. Can't be coincidence. I need to look into it. Now, if only the city wasn't so impossible to navigate. Emergency brick in case you got it out of it. You know, 
distract someone by throwing uh, a brick somewhere. <laughs> we all keep it on us, or in case you get attacked, you have your emergency brick. Even though we carry a shovel that I pull out. Oh, that's right, also add the shovel. The emergency shovel I pull out of my ass. Uh, what the f- <laughs> I don't even know if that saved that one, because if it was important or not, but what the f- I'm sorry, what the fuck? <laughs> it's just casually there. <laughs> you cannot try to tell me that's normal, motherfucker. You cannot try to act like that's like, oh, you know, casually a painting you bring in your fucking house. Nods, what the fuck? <laughs> Finally, you're awake. Oh, god damn it, I'll you. I'll tell you, though, mister. You want to stay on here? You stop making all that noise. Who are you? Sorry, who are you again? You bang your head or something. I'm Victor Olmstead. I own the place. This Dude. place. The devil. I was unconscious when I came in. Did you not see him? Noise? What? What noise are you talking about? Is he forgetting that? I expect my guests to be respectable. Moans, chanting, all that kind of thing. It stops. All right? Let me text Sam, make sure that she's okay. Uh, okay. Yeah, I don't know what he's talking that. about. I don't really remember what happened, but I'll, I'll do my best. Yeah, well, next time it happens, you end up sleeping under the bridge like the other newcomers. You're not exactly friendly with your okay, guests. Okay, jackass. The ones keeping you in business. All these newcomers after the flood. They're stark raven mad. What do you mean? You can't imagine the crazy yeah. notes and books I find after they move out. Only thing they're good for is lighting the kitchen stove. Can I have a look? I knew it. I tell you, no one sane would be interested. And you want to take a look? Well, fine, fine. Take what you wish. Jesus. <laughs> I'm watching you. Oh my god. Keep it down. The nightmare is a dark right, right one. Um, letters from Oakmont. Uh, the city, no matter how badly the flood damage it has an unnatural appeal i can't stop myself from walking even if it means being struck by further visions eastern part harbor near oh so these are each mirrors mirrors on freight one socks me it started when i visited western advent and had a vision at the intersection of purity road and oak street i saw mirrors full of reflections and so untrapped and trying in vain to escape his expression of fear and panic shook me deep after that <laughs> A very tall, skinny man stared following me in the distance. What troubled me is I see him in the reflections, but I have never caught a straight view of this stalker. I'm sure the police will mock me if I come asking for protection. <laughs> it seems it's time to buy a good, trustworthy gun and start to practice. Alright. Static in ears, call the ocean, disgust and exhaustion. Uh, pipe, voices from the pipes, from behind, terrible fetus, pack of no- what the- wait, hold on. After his child vision, I shake in fear at the sound of a child's cry. It happened in Western Reed Heights on Vig Washington Street. I passed Ibon Street and was heading towards Oak Street. But saw it. the thing was running so fast I didn't even understand running what it was. It jumped from the window and the vision struck me immediately. I saw a man, a doctor, hiding in the room. He was writing something with a shaking hand, something like a last will. And then I saw the last thing he's talking about, a fetus on thin pointy legs with a little face full of evil and hatred it's shrieking I can't forget it what the fuck wait where did she even say this was <sighs> how many Western Reed Heights so Western Reed Heights on Washington Street Washington Street past Ibon heading towards Oak Okay, she said Western Reed, so that's left. 
left so left and Reed at Washington Street. Ibon toward past Ibon Street heading towards Oak Street. Okay, so leftward on the heights. Let's look for Washington first. Washington. Washington past Ibon Street on the way to Oaks. Oh, past Ibon Street on Washington on the way to Oaks. So about here. Cool. Alright, that one looked interesting. Well, let's see like what interesting ones you want to look at. I think the fetus one sounds crazy. Uh, Lullaby Crossroad, Innsmouth or Notes, Voices from the Pipe. See if anything like sounds interesting, let me know. Because if you... No, do you want to be like, yo, well, let's look at from behind. Call the ocean, static in the ears. Um... Disgusting exhaustion. No matter how different my vision may be, they always different. Today was a man. He left a house in Southern Old Grove on Warwick Street, somewhere between Seaside and Hillside Streets. Our eyes met, and I immediately felt the burning exhaustion, exalt, exaltation, a wild torrent of emotions. I saw him among the monstrosities, touching them, embracing, kissing. Ugh. The bridge was so intense. I bent in two and threw up all my breakfast. He walked past, saying something like, "Cursed newcomers." I pray he wouldn't stop to help. Oh, even now when I close my eyes, I see the creatures around this man. Oh, gross. You're just mad I know that you're secret, you bitch. <laughs> That's disgusting. That's really gross. That's... Uh, he's like fucking the little wild beast. So <laughs> gross. Southern Old Grove. I mean, Warwick Street. Mm -hmm. Where's Old Grove? Hmm. Southern Oak Grove on Warwick Street. Is that it? Warwick Street. Somewhere between Seaside and Hillside Street. Weird. So... Let's edit on. Disgusting exhaustion. Let's say okay. Okay. New Weird. Alright, so if anything does uh sound interesting to you, Nadia, let me know. My dear Victor, how is Ogmont treating you? Should you acquire any support, the Blackwoods would be happy to help you. Arrange for that. Regarding your question, I don't know what, where Robert went, sadly. Only that he did not stay in his mouth. Perhaps there is a hope he didn't perish in that cursed raid. Take good care of the hotel, please. Plenty of our relatives are interested in property, but you're still my favorite nephew. I know the Devil's Reef is in good hands. Kind regards and Portia. Okay. Kind of nice that people don't mind me just fucking walking around their place. Massive crab, holy shit. Has to be fake. No way there's a crab the size of a small car. Are you fucking stuffed and mounted like that, bro? No way. No way. <laughs> oh, hold on. I'm gonna check over here on this side real quick. Uh, nothing. Okay. Alright, goodbye, jackass. Let us save. Oh gosh, talkies don't fall. Oh. Now my skill points. I don't think I actually gained anything. <laughs> I've also been reading. Okay, so fast trail points. These are the fast trail points. A little uh booth. What kind of local inns math scares me a lot. I've never seen places with so many ill people. Their faces pursue me even in visions. Recently, I was in North Park, Grimhaven Bay, walking down Whisper Street. 
barely made a hubert when the visions came. I stood among the Innsmouthers disguised as one of them. And listen, the leader read the story of a captain participating in pagan rites, copulating with savage witches and beasts, bringing sacrifices. I still remember his name. Obed. Interesting. Interesting. Hmm. Side case was lost at sea. Uh, give me a key to Expedition's headquarters, northern cover site at the crossroad of Asher Road and Hubert Ave. Hmm. Northern cover side. Northern cover side, Asher Road and Hubert Street Ave. And Hubert Ave. There we go. Geez, various um, things to get going right away with, huh? Uh, let's see. Vacation dad doing vacation dad things. Kids, don't you know that getting on the boat? It's so awesome. It's like we're in Venice, Italy. I know you wanted to go to Venice, Italy, Martha, but shut the fuck up. We're not going to Venice, Italy. It's expensive. Here we are on the wonderful Edgewater. Look, they even got their own hipsk clutches for men and women. Come on. Yes, this last step is too high for us to casually go up, but who cares? All I hear are doubters. Fucking doubters. <laughs> You think this man minds this? I, I think he might, might mind this. By sending I don't know. Terrors unnamed Maybe he'll just keep going. Maybe he won't care. Atone for your deeds before it's too late. Love it, Theo, my good old kitty boy. So I think anything that has that dash mark, I'm able to like enter and mess with. So keep an eye on stuff like that, like named places. With that little H mark. Let's definitely start heading towards the key though. Let's go main quest for now. Because everything else is in other areas. Right? Yeah, because we're in cover side, everything else involves going to like Reed Heights. Old Grove. Other places. Hey, hey, stop messing with my ear, my headset, bro. Rude. Rude ass cat. Do you not understand me when I say go away? Kitty cat, huh? Hmm? You think I'm playing with you, don't you? That's why you're purring? Hmm? Is that what you're purring? Hmm? You think I'm playing with you? When you paw my goatee and try to play and basically comb my goatee with your little claws. You cute little fucking light skinned tabby. Yeah, yeah, you like that? You half fucking Scottish fold? You half little Scottish fold bitch. Get out of here. Get out of here, you little punk ass. <laughs> uh, I'm such a menace to my cat sometimes. I give him so many kisses, it freaks him out. Maybe that's a little bit mean, even if it's a lot of love. Let's <laughs> stop at the police department. Or well, right here. Let's see if we can get any information. I forget how helpful they are in this game. Whether they're very helpful or not at all, you know? <laughs> I hope these are like newsstands, not like fucking guard posts. <laughs> okay, I don't got the rail system up and running anymore. Okay. Yeah, you see... You know, I get it. I get it, Colts and all that, but like, I need your help. <laughs> My wife, Martha, she left me, and I'm not really sure she's with this... <laughs> hey. Hello, officer. Well, look who finally decided to show up. 
If it ain't Charles Reed, the genius to crack the case about okay, the Okay, Jesus. Order. What's Captain up, bro? Caleb Lyons at your service. What can we simpletons do to assist you, Mr. Holmes? Chill, homie. Your problem? You and I have a problem, officer. No, no. Aside from making everyone in the Oakmont Police Department look like idiots, let me be frank. Do I have to kick you your ass? Up. You ain't welcome. You slip up, don't cross a T or dot an I, and I'll treat you like every other criminal here. What do you mean? Well, can I use the police archive in the meantime? You can, but only because of Mr. Throgmorton's patronage. And heed me well, you're on. You're such an asshole. I didn't do anything wrong. Okay, forgot you're gonna try to get to the bag. Let me. Listen, you little furball of just menace in society. That's right, go play with everyone else. Go, goodbye. Love you, goodbye. Okay. So, we have access to stuff, but the cops are jerks. Okay, cool. We can come back here if we need access to anything. I don't think I can loot anything here. Out of spite. <laughs> Take his fucking bullets or something, you know? Goddamn Charles Reed stealing my bullets. I knew he was nothing but trouble. I knew it. I told Martha we never should let him around. Oh, nice little running jump. Holy shit. Look at us go. Just be, oh, sorry, man. <laughs> okay. Um, and it's on this area, so we gotta try to figure out where. We gotta find something with a mark on it nearby. Don't do that again. Oh, really? Hey, whoa, dogs, chill. No. Jesus. Mute me for a second. Hold on. Necessary. What the hell? Hey, right, look, I think this might be an expedition. <laughs> Ooh. Mmm. Someone kicked it down. <laughs> yes, I, you're right. I guess I don't need that fucking key. Could have just showed up here without Throgmorton's courtesy. I could have just came here. Could have been like, look, I'm going to investigate with or without you, Throgmorton. You bastard. <laughs> Divers with the bends can suffer from numerous symptoms of clean pain, impaired movement, nausea, vomiting, and disorientation. Acute symptoms can occur within 10 minutes of surfacing and include paralysis, numbness, blindness, deafness, dizziness, seizures, confusion, and words coming out all weird. Ah. The paralysis and numbness can involve several different parts of the body at the same time. Okay, that's terrifying. Are a few damp papers all that's left of the expedition? Okay, so someone broke in, clearly. Ransacked someone the smashed fucking place. The Jesus. Man, that was nice, man. Who would do such a thing? Oh, fucking simpletons or whom. Hold on. Um... In like a minute when my phone's at 10%, I'm gonna need to move. Actually, you know, just because of the time we have. Oh, man. Let me some things real quick. I get a charging cord for my phone. Was a lot of shit that scared me. My God. Phone is charging. Excuse me. 
Excuse me. Are a few damp papers all that's left of the expedition? What are you trying to show me, bird? What's happening? Oh. God. Um. That's gonna affect my sanity. Let's go. Take a deep breath for a minute. <laughs> oh, God. Those gross ass heels. Take a deep breath, buddy. Okay, according to our data, I have to protect. The places of paranormal activity have a strong previously unidentified influence on the human mind. They prepared a list of solutions, including meditative practices and supply of sedatives to prevent cases of madness among the expedition members. I highly recommend discarding all those charms, amulets, and religious symbols which are of no use and applying these scientifically valid methods of protection instead. H. Doe. Okay. Can't say I ever saw another shell like it. Basically, screw your religion. It will not keep you safe. These are scientifically religious activities that are going on. Valid, I suppose. <laughs> if this is all true. Which I guess in this world it looks like it's pretty fucking. These samples glitter shown. in a weird way. I wonder where they came from. It's. Is it not like emerald or um, jade? El Sullivan and B. Morgan, local fishermen, report numerous large bubbles and an unbearable stench rising from the bottom of the sea. Fishermen reports. Okay, I uh, bought a sample of a weird substance floating in the ocean from Jay Harvey. He claims he found it among numerous dead and strange deformed fish. They were taken for analysis. Several locals mentioned a rock that rose from the seabed, making the fog shine in different colors. The witnesses felt sick and dizzy for two or three days after the incident. L.P. Stern got severe burns after chiseling off a piece of the rock in his basement. Samples taken for analysis. What the f- Oh, God, that's the rock. We could've got burns. The Oakmont University Department of Anthropology welcomes the newest addition to his ranks, Professor Harry Dome. The uh, brilliant discoveries about the origin of Inuit tribes have added to the new page to the history book of humanity. Now, Professor Doe will embark on a new expedition to hopefully shed light on the, s the almost source of the flood. And in doing so, shed light on what they may yet to come. Yeah, that's all. Oh. Yeah, 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 I can take a bigger body. Give me, um, like, two seconds to okay. save, and then I'll come back. This is at the door, so I don't wanna... Okay, yeah, I can come do it right now, then. Okay, I gotta go get my dog to the potty. I'll be right back. Okay, so sorry for the wait.
I'm back. Call me shady. I'm back. <laughs> Call me shady. I'm shady. Whoa, that's really <laughs> hazardously suspended. Do you hear something? Is it this way? Oh shit. One shot, one hit. Whew, for saving the bullets. <laughs> well, motherfucker. Dare take a shot at me, I'll take a fucking picture of you with that. <sighs> oh god, this thing got fucked up. Uh, guess this helmet's beyond repair. Yeah, uh, I mean, no way we can use it. At the very least, that's what you're inquiring. Okay, I think taking a single shot is fine. We didn't really do anything too bad. Whoa. Am I gonna see anything yet? Appears that man was here to uh, destroy stuff. Appears like the in mouth is uh, fucking with my shit. Oh, here we go. It's probably must be no later than Friday. MK. Uh, Mark 5 diving suit, 6. Air tanks and pumps, canned foods, 18. Personal belongings, 6 crates. Nambling. Research equipment, 7 crates. Do not detect, no, unreadable. Air pipes, 24. Phone station and wires, 1. Power generator, 1. Responsible for delivering. I always have a backup generator, but maybe that's just me. So we have the cargo manifest. I think we have the break in too. Okay, we're gonna do this. <sighs> we don't have time to pick it. Stand back. Okay. Grab the papers. Smash the rest. Smash the rest. I fatah me a fei regach. I a Dagon. Burn it all. Make sure you get the adverts. Time to figure this out. The adverts. Why the adverts? This is easy. We don't have time to pick it. Stand back. Grab the papers. Smash the rest. Three. I fatah. Four, right? Burn it all. Make sure you get the adverts. Several men broke into the expedition headquarters. Clearly. <laughs> they didn't smash, they burned. The archives, even the newspapers. <sighs> Why are we keeping I All I had to do was kill a guy. Several men with Innsmouther syndrome. If this was a syndrome. An expedition archive is lost. I still have clues to follow upon them. They left the city on the freighter from Grovenhaven Bay. There might be recent postings or ads from the freighter in the Oakmont Chronicle. Yeah, let's go. Um, let's look at the map. Okay, we haven't gotten everything here. Oakmont Chronicle is just on the other side. Okay, what haven't I gotten? Hmm? What well, haven't I checked out? My impudent game. My impudent young game. How can I help you? What do you need me to look for? You don't got nothing for me, real. Harpoons. I'm sure if someone was here, they could have fought back, but for now, there's nothing really. 
No one was here. Can't say I ever I saw another been. shell like it. Just a regular ham, please. Maybe with like uh, that pepperoni or salami. With that pepperoni or salami too, please. Dos. You want two salmonos? Yes, please. Oh, thank you. She's the best. I mean, one of the best. Can't say I ever saw another shell like it. What can I say? <laughs> she asked for my help. I got a sandwich. It's like a trade. <laughs> to be fair, I also have to do that trade with her. Uh, all of her stuff for help. Only occasionally, though. Usually she's just a very fucking forthcomingly amazing, kind person. Anything I can... No, can't look into anything here. That guy's fucking dead, Jesus. It must just be like a searchable, right? Cause if it's just some random searchable, I'm gonna be so annoyed. Or if it's like an actual quality piece of evidence, I'll be well, relatively satisfied. Relatively. Let's see if we can find anything else. Alright, I'm calling it. It's just a searchable. We're gonna leave. We, I think, got everything that we really fucking good of. Like, what? I don't. What do you want from me? <laughs> Someone smashed it beyond repair. Yeah, this doesn't affect anything. Yeah, now I'm just driving myself crazy. Alright, let's get out of here. <laughs> um, anything like expedition? Nothing? Okay. Let us be gone. Let's go into the Chronicle then. I'll have to look at evidence and try to look up the newspaper clippings and such. What's the problem? What's your problem? How about you go fuck yourself? How about that, sir? Mm -mm -mm, yummy, yummy. Fruit salad. <laughs> What's this? Is this? Ooh, fast travel point. Perfect. I think if I remember correctly, we had to go down the road to get to the Chronicles. Household chemistry, huh? Maybe if you're open, I could have bought some shit from you, but whatever. Whatever. Fuck your US mail system. I want to try something. I just, I just need to know. Judge me if you must. Now I just feel bad. We might as well pull her out of her misery. Come on, ma'am. There we go. Yeah, that's right. Murder the innocent. Murder the innocent. <laughs> Holy shit. It killed me. <laughs> Is that is that bad on my my mental state? Okay. <laughs> ah, so nods. What do you think so far about this game? Let me know. Tell me.
do 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 you're adorable nuts do do you're adorable hmm just like the last one interesting but like definitely different definitely different <laughs> A lot more open violence. <laughs> okay, let us actually physically load our manual scene. <laughs> yeah, I think it just put me in like an auto save area. I want to go to physical manual save. Such a hobo sign, okay. That's what they're called. Hobo signs. The man eating eels, okay, if you're a strong swimmer, avoid staying in the water for too long. Oh. Man eating eels, okay. Hmm. <laughs> come on, I know I took a while to load, but damn, come on. Oh, where, where? Okay, cool. Just put me over here, anyways. Good to know. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse you. <coughs> Which way am I going? Hold on. Shit. <coughs> I gotta go straight. Take a left. Ooh, I can take a left and get in her faster roll point. So go straight left. Oh, but there's a wall. Must be like an infected zone. Okay, okay. You might want to swing down there and grab that then, just in case, because natural points are pretty good in this game, from what I remember. Really important. <coughs> oh my god. Let me see, where is it? Left. Let me go down left. I want to see why it's all boarded up before we actually do the Oakmont Chronicle. Actually, I will do the Oakmont Chronicles first. Change my mind a lot. <laughs> the old papers are by the door. Take them and stop bothering me already. I think, think you've got me confused, honey. <laughs> Aren't you a newcomer? Uh, was that? I, I mean, yeah, I only got in recently. Yeah, I guess I am a newcomer. Charles Reed, private investigator. And I also need your old newspapers, uh, the archive, to be exact. Ah, so so you're the one who cracked the Albert Throgmorton murder Hell yeah, case. Bro. Nice work. I'm Helen Bland. Say, can you what do can me I a say? favor? Give me an exclusive interview. You won't regret it. The Oakmont. <sighs> All right, I'll uh, be sure to make some. What? Well, I'll do it right now. You still want that in? Oh, absolutely. We know that you're the private eye who solved the case. Yeah. Tell our reader something what about it, sweetie? about yourself. I served in the Navy. I'm an investigator from Boston. I'm a private eye in Boston. There you go. The situation in the port was a good use of my skills. Well, uh, Detective Reed, I I think you'll find our city has a lot True, of I can tell that already. <laughs> uh, but people may not like you poking your nose in. Uh, maybe we'll have the chance to work together later. <laughs> Who knows? And now the big question. Why are you here? What brought you to Oakmont? Looking for a source of vision. That's it. Easy. Currently, Bye. Nothing. I'm tracking down the source of the psychic phenomenon that's been causing madness and visions all across the country. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, it affected people here, but we were much more concerned with the flood. Though Robert Throgmorton sent an expedition. Yeah, and then hired me to find it. Ironic, don't you think? I 
think that's enough for now. I can't give the readers too much all at once. Thank you for your interview, Mr. Reed. My pleasure. And maybe I'll do something interesting enough to make the papers again. You never know. See you later. Probably. I'm pretty interesting. What can I say? Hmm. I like saving a lot. Makes me feel comfortable. <sighs> I'm a nerd. <laughs> so we can do this. I want to go explore a minute. Loot whatever I can. <coughs> <coughs> excuse me. Ooh, excuse me. I was about to ask why would a newspaper have the bullets, but then I forgot that it's basically currency. Might even have people buying them. A newspaper with bullets, oh my god. Using large caliber rounds to like... Buy bulk? Okay. Interesting. Very perplexing. <laughs> oh, very, very interesting. I'm not in that type of vaccine, but but we interesting either way. Nope. Oh yeah. Yeah. Here I am. Once again, feeling lost, but now and then, breathing in, Maxie. Let it go. Don't you got to know? <laughs> okay. Um. Oh, thank God, it's right there. Okay. Uh. Last. Okay. They left the city of a freighter from Grimhaven Bay. There might be recent postings or ads. Okay. Um. Period. It's all old school. Current events. And Grimhaven Bay. I suppose I would have to do like celebrities, officials, commoners, journalists. I don't know. After the flood, I don't know what the fucking. Mm. Hmm. Maybe advertisements. Ooh, a 30 ton ship Titania is currently available for hire. You'll find it fully equipped for transport as well as the aiding of underwater adventures and exploration for the price of 70 rifle bullets or the equivalent there for per week. Those interested in are urged to contact Captain Jeremiah Sanders for contracting details. He can be found at the Pier 3 Oak. Montport, Grimhaven Bay. Okay. That's not bad. Uh, Grimhaven Bay. That's the place we were just at, right? Okay, let's go down here and get this. Oh, this is Devil's Reef. Okay, that's why it's already shown. Gotcha. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, then in that case, let's swing here. Grab anything that's nearby here. Go down. Towards Grimhaven. Okay, some minor exploration in order to uh, basically just oh, save time later, because we're already kind of right here. What's up, douchebag? Let me see where are we? In my case book. Mm-hmm, I tell me. Um... Yeah, I'll just go straight across. Probably get a fast travel point just by coming over here. Oh, wait, thank There's you. There's no more hands, but it's also on me. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. would have made a fantastic late night surprise. 
<laughs> oh no, that gentleman's dead in infested area. Okay, let's save and go to the infested area. See what's about. See what it's about. About 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 about. Mmm, troubles. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Well, it's infested, huh? Okay, oh. Severely so. Okay. Holy crap. Quick loot. Oh god, quick loot. Quick loot. Fuck. Quick loot, quick loot, quick loot. Oh shit, this is not really quick loot, is it? Okay, oh, I need to move. Let me get out of here. Yeah, I need to go. I need to go. Not worth it. Well, not worth it, but not worth it to continue. <laughs> Plenty of materials, that's neat. Foot traps, what the hell? Oh yeah, really jabbing that needle. <laughs> hmm. More ammo though, not bad. Unless I got like a lot of crafting supplies from what I can tell. Mm-mm-mm. Get a little hot dog <laughs> Or sandwich, but whatever. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. -mm. Mm, fish market. Okay. Oh Jesus. <laughs> there is a fast roll point right here. I believe. Mm-hmm. When I can tell to do. Okay. And then from here, let's head down. Go to Salvation Harbor. Let's see if we can get anything in Salvation Harbor. Basically, set the little quick points to grab to go to different areas. Make it a little bit easier for us. Or in the long run. In the long run. Make it easy in the long run. Going down is a piece. I got to cut in here, <clears throat> sir. My good. Oh, they got little, little signs, little road signs. Abolition Street? Okay. Let's take a right, I suppose. Okay, I can go faster. Okay, good. Uh, go right. Oh, I can park here. What can I get here? Oh. Jesus. I actually think I have to come here. In the future. You moron. Feel clever now, Lewis, leaving that poor bastard chained up in the basement. He got flooded. Good luck getting Mr. Carpenter's money from him now. I'm out. I'm not gonna just sit here and wait for you, the Grim Reaper. Carpenter will feed you to the eels like a blunder. For a blunder like this. Okay. Let's save and explore this area. I have a uh, gut feeling we're supposed to come here later. From my base, remember. Save me some time. Oh god. Okay, down here is disgusting. Am I able to go down at all? No. I have to have something to help me go down, I suppose.
Who's there? Heard a creature or something up here. 38 pissed around. Okay, just round in the chamber, whatever. I definitely heard something. I don't think this is the place I thought it was, but interesting little place either way. Hmm. I kind of want to explore down there, but I feel like I'm going to take damage, so let's save. If we die, we'll end up at a different place. Never mind. I actually don't want to do that. It's still going to be a waste of my time. Even with the save. Um. Get me out. Thank you. <laughs> Killer eels, right? Get me the fuck out. <laughs> I was wrong though from my prediction that I needed that. <laughs> okay, I just gotta get to the left here. There's an infested area. Which way? Oh, towards the way I was about to go. Okay. Maybe I can avoid it. No, I was trying to actually go that way. Let's go towards it. We'll just see what happens. We're gonna be just saved. <sighs> gotta get through, gotta get through. Compulsive saving, let's go. Okay. Quick energizing bite of food. Mm hmm. Delicious. As always. And prepared by your mother. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Okay, quick loot. More emergency bricks. You know how we love them here. The emergency bricks you carry in your khakis. Mmm. Three emergency bricks now. We're getting fancy. Oh god. Excuse me. I need to loot and run. At least look for a place I can cut into. Oh, that's they're disgusting. And terrifying, and they come out of the ground, what the fuck? That's what you mean by infestation? Oh, they're just kinda... Oh, wow, you can't stop them. You can't stop them. You can't stop them, get me out of here. So wait, we have an area just in here. It can just come to us. Terrifying. I don't like that. I don't like that very much at all. That was, uh, not very pleasant. But, very, very profitable, it seems. Maybe even worth it, some may say. Ho <laughs> ho! Oh, Aha! Hee hee! Okay. Jesus. She's just going left, right? Mm. Yeah, she's just going left. <laughs> oh, right. Have to make sure of both. Okay, let's go down and take it right. Mm hmm. Down this way. <laughs> what can I do? Can't loot that even though I had the hobo sign, whatever. Okay, what's happening over there? Oh, that's just because it's a quick trip to get to, I assume, an infestation area. <laughs> Our favorite areas. Compulsive saving. Okay, yeah, I guess I gotta go probably just through here, right? 
Hmm, compulsive saving. Wow, it's really open. Your little areas that they can come through. No wonder things are so fucking dangerous here. Can I come through? Can I come through? Can I come through? Thank you. Can't care anymore. Okay. Can I craft? Ooh, I have an abundance. Let's shoot a few things. Let's just see how it feels. Okay, Terminator. Look at the outward arm just fucking boo, boo, boo. Oh really? Oh wow, this really is just fucking infested. Oh wow, okay, yeah, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna die, we're gonna run. Not worth it. I mean, like, <laughs> maybe worth the XP if you can survive. That's kind of what XP is, you know, it's experience. You, you, you had to experience something, right? Oh god. Oh god, don't kill me. Please. Oh, barely made it. Barely made it. Barely made it. Can I craft first aid kits, please? Okay. Some bullets. There we go. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, that was not where I mean, that was, I guess, fine. Oh, I just feel stressful. <laughs> okay. Double quest reward items. Interesting, that's not bad. No charity. Gain more experience from all sources. Early on, it must be back, right? Yeah. We'll just do that one more. 10% bonus. Then we'll probably gonna bigger or combat proficiency. I don't know. We'll see. Hmm. Let me heal. <laughs> no need it. Even if it's just minor, it keeps me alive. Little fucking thing, gross ass. Like little rats, like little flood rats. Oh, I want them gone. I want them dead. They're disgusting. <laughs> Grimhaven Bay South, okay. Now we can look to our casebook. Pier 3, Oakmont Port. Um, pier three. Okay. Uh, I would assume it's the this one, right? Kind of the long way, but whatever. I'll see what we explore. Um, what we encounter. Let me heal again. <laughs> that did not feel good. That ass kicking I got, you know? <laughs> mm, I don't like going through the alleyway. <laughs> Let's continue. <laughs> you know, if you pull out a gun, I'm sure people will scatter. I wonder if it, they do the same thing if you pull out, like, a camera. They're like, oh, fuck, he's got flash photography. Jesus! <laughs> you guys arguing? Jesus. I know you gotta scrounge, but, like, it can be frustrating, but come on, man, chill. Life is only harder when you make it harder. Life can go so much harder for no reason, but that's besides the point. <laughs> okay, holy shit. So I was able to whack out like one or two of those little things, plus 
I wasn't even able to kill one of the spitters. I, I had to fucking whack the, uh, I thought I killed one, but then I, I don't think I did in the end. I think in the end I ended up just wasting some bullets on it. Trying to fight. I did get a level, at least, but, but geez, you know, all that work to basically have gotten my ass kicked. Alright, this is a place I can explore. Oh, got things in it. Go. Good shots. Oh, foot trap, okay. <laughs> Die, you wild beast. Die, wild beast. That thing's dead, yeah? Now it's you. Okay, well, mm. Oh, you're back up, man. Yeah? Did you just die for me, bro? Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Why don't you die? Do they not die? Holy shit. Good thing I say frequently, hmm? Mm hmm. Actually, I actually don't think I say it before that, but still. Relatively frequently. <laughs> Does it take me back to that shave or should I go? Bioshock type thing. I still use the resources. I'm somehow alive. <laughs> Let us see. I still have the resources. I'm here. Okay, cool. Let's go try that again. <laughs> You can use foot traps to help. Maybe. Start with uh, offing the wild beast. And then. Then I think we go for the big boys. Even then, I think if we off the wild beast, you might just run around and loot. Look around without fighting the other guys. I don't know. Then my ghost go to XP though. Kind of weighing the pros and cons in my head, you know. Trying that again would require me to have to do this whole little section again. I think one more try is fine. A third try. We'll see how well this try goes. If this goes really well and I barely don't make it, third try. Maybe even fourth. But if we get like just wrecked again, pff, we're not gonna. We're not gonna waste our freaking time. Oh wow, you're like immediate. Okay, I have to physically, okay. It's not going well. I think this area is randomized too, more than I thought. Let's just run. 
I don't think this is a, a good place for me to try and fight. Best I do, best I do. Gain, yeah. Haven't killed him yet. Diary from the factory. There's something wrong with Mr. Murphy. He's not whispering. He's not yelling at us, usual. No one's not eating or even moving from his wheelchair. We're getting a knife now. Some snub killed Mr. Murphy. Cut his head off in arms and left him in the corner. Well, several workers have also disappeared. Relatives say they didn't return from work yesterday morning. I don't want to think about this, but Mr. Murphy's remnants have already started to rot. I spoke with him just yesterday, or it wasn't Mr. Murphy. else down there? A few things I assume. I'll basically here just for some XP. <laughs> I see if it's worth it too, you know. Yeah, I mean we're getting some uh, some fair stuff. See if we get anything downstairs. Let's see if we die. <laughs> there we go. And I'll shot that also shot that thing quite a bit, so at least I got the XP for it. Which made it more worth it. <laughs> so I believe we looted this. Oh we haven't looted it yet. Oh I couldn't carry anymore. Okay. So maybe crafting and getting the XP isn't the worst idea I've ever had. So at least I get some XP, right? <laughs> Which means I can level up quicker, etc, etc. And I can loot this place and get any lore story. Okay. Looks like that was mostly just XP. Eh, that's fine. It's fine. I'd say it was worth it. Got us a little bit more combat proficient. So much so, I'll even save. I saved. Oh no. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I will admit. That's abundance. That's okay. We don't need this. <laughs> that kind of helped, I guess. <laughs> Not by much, though. So. I'll be sad if clearing those things out don't even minorly impact the ending. Like, wow, you really cleaned up the shitty. Thank you, Mr. Beer. Or not Beer. Mr. Reed. So kind. So caring. Mwah, mwah, you know? Bye bye. Ah, gross ass fucking thing. Okay, loot. Yeah, it looks like we're gonna get, if we take a half a second to even look around, we get so much darn loot that it kind of makes it worth it just to go for the XP. Ah, oh, well, thank you, sir. But I'm okay. Appreciate it, though. Really. Really, I do. Now we can get the fast travel here, which is BS and let's get the fast travel before we had to pass out, apparently, before we get the fucking fast travel. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> I'm not mad, you're mad.
I think this is the bay I tried to go to before, and I thought something was going to happen on it. Apparently, <laughs> I had to do this part first. Yeah, goddammit. <laughs> Shit went wrong. Hmm. At last. Hey, help. Help. What's going on? S sea creatures swarmed over the piers. I hid here, but these walls won't stand up to them. Please help me. Warber. What? What creatures? What are you talking about? Wild beasts. They came to feast on the blood. They eaten the dead. I'm looking for Captain Sanders. Is he here in the port? Did the creatures get him? I, I saw Sanders. Help me. I, I'll tell you what. Yeah, I yeah, know. everyone at surprise. Okay. Everyone's got a price. I don't know which one's stronger, so I'm just gonna stick with my handgun that fires faster. And again, this one shot's the wild beast. Oh shit, unless I miss. Really? Didn't die. The harbor has been cleared. What happened? Hmm? They emptied every chamber. Ah, still stinks of burnt powder. Shot dead. Point blank. Poor guy. Now don't... Don't give me the visions. Don't give me the visions. Don't give me the shivers. The convulsions. Oh well. To do this to a man. Ah, the monsters sure didn't leave behind much. God. Um. Oh, it's because I'm out of my mind. I'm gonna envision stuff. I need to take a moment. I need to take a moment. Happened all at once. Let's see if we can figure out what happened. Yeah. Let me go back to the port guy. Ew. This would be a weird artifact in any collection. Ew. Cape Cod. No marks here, but they've been erased. Why would they be erased? Like someone, like they want someone to figure out where they went, huh? I see. Shining a light on you. I, Captain Jeremiah Sanders, hereby agree to take on board my vessel, Titania. Any persons designated by Robert Rogmoy in the cargo detailed in the attached manifest, as well as to provide them with any and all necessary assistance to and including depth measurements, as well as diving support for underwater exploration and marine life observations. Information services will take place in confidential locations in Kata Bay. Afterwards, the Titania will provide transport for all passengers to Oakmont Port. Compensation will be 70 bullets. One week, huh? I mean, gosh, yeah, it's right outside. Makes sense. The whole thing is mostly for, um... We're in high spirits. And plenty of them were drinking. All about the fact that they were just outside the bay. So the boat came back. Without everybody. Let's break this shit down. Let's break it down! Ah, you can't take me! Eat this! Alright, Sanders. What the hell happened, bro? To the mayor with you! Ugh. Die! Die! Oh wow, one guy got thrown over the edge. Immediately axed down another gent. And this gentleman started going after Captain Sanders. No more drink. 
with all we've seen. seen. And you telling me we ain't allowed rough? Let's get a handle on what actually happened here. No more drink. All we've seen. And you telling me we ain't allowed rough? Easy, right? Pretty easy setup to figure out. That a matter with you. Die. 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 You can't take me. Eat this. For whatever reason, the crew went berserk. Only one man got away. I don't say but drink. I don't Shot think dead. Point they do it just off a drink, right? I'd hope not. What else am I missing here? What else am I missing? I bet not be kissing destiny. My girl would be mad if she caught her with me. Once again in the bed of luck. Every now and then I gotta say I don't give a fuck. I don't know what else I can get. It's probably just, once again, another lootable. And it looked a little boat dinghy we could probably use later on. Probably just lootable. Let's go and talk to the guy. Hmm? Hmm. Surprise didn't pop up. Oh, you got all the evidence. Hmm. I've dealt with the creatures. Now, now tell me. me about Sanders. He got back several hours ago. Things it came because of him. Because of him? Or like what happened with the boat? What happened on Titania? It was horrible. A damn massacre. I heard the shots. I went out. I saw the whole thing. Sailors bleeding, dying. Blood hit the water, and then well then the wild beasts came to feast. Yeah, the beast came to feast. Yeah, the beast came to feast. Well, what kind of man is Sanders? Sanders. And what kind of man is he? Uh, newcomer. See, <sighs> like a decent guy. Okay, Captain. Treated his crew well. Okay, well, where is she now? I gotta find Sanders. Where is he? Saw him get away. The last thing we do before entry. Just after the shooting. Ran for the pier. Didn't see where he went after that. Did, uh, did you see anyone else from the expedition? No. Only Sanders. I'd bet my life no one else made it back. Just those two, huh? The mayor's cursed these days. Alright. <sighs> damn it. Damn it, damn it. Oh, excuse me. Time charter contract events are titanium. Uh, the wounded sailor Sanders has fled. Saw Captain Sanders leave the pier. The only survivor of the fight on the third pier at the Grim Haven Bay was a man badly wounded in his shoulder. Captain Sanders is a wounded man and is now seeking medical aid. Yep, we'll start with that later. Yeah, it has no connection. Wounded Sanders, though. We will start next time with that. It is late. And I need to go to fucking bed. Thank you very much for watching if you happen. If you haven't, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. 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 Bye now. Bye-bye now. Get the fuck out. Leave.